Papa. He went straight down when Dad started scratching him. Aw. But Buckeye wouldn't do that. Oh, he's big. <laughs> Buckeye wouldn't do that because he's too, like, focused with food right now. Aw. Dad, I did that one time with Clover. This time I'm gonna make him point. Huh? Come on. Squeeze his belly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. Good pick. I actually made Buckeye roll over. Good boy. But then I have mud on me. And later today, I have a basketball. Well, two basketball, uh, ball, ball, two basketball tournament games. And if I win one, I'll play on Sunday. So hopefully I can. I cannot see because of the sun. But yeah, pa I made Paw Paw and Buckeye roll over. And I made Lavender and Clover roll over too one time. Paw Paw stopped sniffing the camera. So Meadow was bred in like November, late November. Yeah, Meadow was bred like late November or something. And her due date supposed to be the end of March. And we have noticed that her udder has filled up a little bit. And I've kind of like felt it and like it does feel filled up. So like Meadow is definitely pregnant. And her due date's supposed to be the end of March, which is like like two or three weeks from now. Which means we're gonna have baby goats really soon. Meh meh. And it it's gonna be Meadow's first birth first birth ever. And she was bred with Ringo because we tried to breed her with Kubo, but he was kind of sick at the time, so he couldn't really breed her. So, Meadow bred with Ringo. And so we're gonna have like gray and white and black babies. Mostly gray and white. Cause Meadow is gray. She has a little bit of black fur, but she's mostly like gray and white. And Ringo is mostly white with some black patches. So I just don't know what kind of colors or what kind of babies are gonna come out of her. <laughs> Dad, what do you think? Do you think Meadow's gonna have pretty babies? I love Meadow. I think she's gonna make beautiful babies. Yes. You're a good, good goat. And this is what her udder looks like. See, it's kind of filled up and her teats have kind of like went to the side. So definitely, meh meh, good girl. But then again, her, this side has the babies and this side has her food, but this side's kind of small, so I think she's just gonna have one baby. Meh meh. Like we missed, all of our goat births on this farm. So Meadow, we better not miss yours. Oh gosh, when you do that, it looks huge. <laughs> meh meh. Cause we missed, ha so Halo has had kids twice and we missed both of them. And then Juno had a kid and Juno was uh, one of the first goats we had. Hey, we got Halo and Juno together they were our first goats on the farm, but we had to sell Juno because she was bullying Meadow. And then we sold Halo because her udder was like getting too close to the ground and one of her babies died because of that. Because they couldn't drink out of her udder, so we had to sell her. 
and her other baby Shadow because Shadow's horns were like all wacky. So now we just have Meadow, Zero, and then Ringo and Kubo back behind the barn. And Meadows is our only girl. So you better have beautiful babies, Mima. Okay? Okay. My dad has cleared a lot of this out. Or a lot of the trees out. And here they are. And we're gonna go burn them in that burn pile way over there. Some of these trees are dead. A lot of them are just like vines or weeds. Dead weeds. That is a tree, definitely. So is that. I think this is a tulip tree that the pigs killed. I don't know. Or it was just a tree that didn't get its leaves yet this year. But now I'm gonna water the boys. Oh. Dad, this water's heavy and cold on my leg. So we are cleaning out the pig pen so they have more room for grass to grow so they can eat it during the summer. So I'm gonna take some of the trees my dad cut down over to that burn pile way back there. I don't know if I'm pointing it in the I can't see, because it's really bright up. But I love this place right now. And I am super girl. Wanna know why? So this bucket is really dirty. So I'm gonna clean it out. I have finished. It looks a lot cleaner than what it was. It actually doesn't even look like it has water. Yeah, it doesn't look like it has water in it right now. It's so clean. Ain't that right, Zero? So a mouse thought it was a good idea to jump in here and poop all over the place. But it's dead. Starved to death. Most likely, hey dad, can you dump that somewhere, please? I'm just gonna dump it in the yard. Maybe thank you, Frank, thank you. Man. Where is he? I don't know. I'm gonna put it over here, by the Inside the new big pan. <laughs> Me either. So right now it's in the 70s and the pigs are eating their lettuce. And earlier they dumped their water right, like, well not right, like a couple minutes after we just filled it up. 
Buckeye. And I, I just got out here and I'm hot. Dad, I just got out here and I'm hot. Ugh. We gotta get used to it though. It's not even spring yet. Buckeye, you've been drinking that for like a minute. <laughs> that, that that was not the noise he made, but um, he made a weird noise. The guy. Well, I'm getting past some of this overbrush here, this twigs and bushes. Oh, these stupid cars! Yeah. So loud. Uh, so that the grass can go in here. So we're gonna pile up some wood on here and have a little fire. Just to burn this out. So that's what we're doing right now. And we're also gonna have another fire with all the trees back there. It's really tall. But yeah, that's what we're gonna do. It's gonna be a lot of fires tonight. It's almost spring and we already have a little bit of a nest here and a nest there and I don't really see any other nest right now but there's at least two um, nests in this these vines and I have spring allergies. So, I might be sneezing a lot this spring. Dinky, I hear that. And there's also a wasp nest in here. Nest, wasp nest. Ugh. And there's none over there. Dinky! Get out. Come on. Come on.
What are you doing? You ran right past me. You ran right past me. You ran right past. Buckeye. You ran right past me too. Buckeye. Why didn't you tell him I was in there, huh? Papa. You should have saw me in there staring right at you. Oh, you little tongue. Oh, you little tongue. Big tongue. What is on your tongue? You don't have a tongue out. Nope. Tongue! Papa. That was funny. Thank you guys for watching today's video. Please make sure to like and subscribe. And I am super happy Meadow is pregnant. Although she is probably going to have one, I'm really happy for her because it's her first pregnancy. And I'm super excited. And I hopefully it doesn't go bad or the baby gets stuck. And it took a long time to get those twigs in a big pile in the pig pen. And then the pigs had to come over and mess it all up, which is very annoying, but we did it in the end. And anyways, see you guys next time on this crazy farm.